here we go. I'm about to straighten my hair and then I'm going to cut. I'm not sure how much I'm going to cut, but um, I just did not go as drastic as I want. So this side is going to be a little bit lower. As far as, as far as straight, my hair is just a little bit damp right now, but it is clean. As far as straightening my hair, I'm going to do um, the method that I did the same way I always straighten my hair. Not that I straighten it that much, but how I did it um, with my black hair before I cut it. And I will put that video link um, in the bottom. Right now I'm just picking it out and then I'm going to straighten. And I'm definitely going to fast forward with you guys through that process. Um, like I said, just watch the other video to see exactly what I use and how I straighten it. I just want you guys to kind of see the cut more with it picked out. trying to decide if I'm going to cut now or cut after, got my new shears, or cut after flat ironing. More than likely, I'm going to do it after flat ironing. Let me get these open. For the record, I am not a professional. I am what they call a kitchen beautician. So, just putting it out there. Yeah, I'm gonna, um, let me ponder for it. Okay, so I'm all I'll straightened and can't figure out how I want to cut it. What I have noticed is that still my ends are so dry. So the color is definitely, you know, damaging my hair. Um, the color and, I guess, me straightening, straightening it. But I knew that was going to happen when I went platinum blonde again. Watch the other video. Talks about me doing a big chop again, going back black, purple red, all that other kind of stuff. So, now I'm kind of trying to figure out what I want to do with these guys. Kind of bring it back like that to see if I want to do it like that or what. Okay guys, so I'm back and what I did was I cut a little bit off um just so that when I actually do make it back to my stylist she will have something to work with but at the same time enough to make me comfortable with the style right now so I had someone will bring her from around I had someone come and help me but they weren't camera ready so I had to turn the camera off but um pretty much they just came and cut that off for me neither one of us are professionals but again kitchen beautician I'm good with that you might not be all right so what I'm gonna do now is go back and um, bump this back some. I have this just rotted from when I did it earlier just so it can keep the shape and I'll be back. I'll come back with you guys when I'm over here um, flat iron that part. Alright, so what I'm doing now is just adding about that much coconut oil all over. And I'm going back with the glaze. I want this to lay a little bit more. I'm not using my favorite gel because that weighs my hair up more than this. I do want it a little bit harder than the glaze makes it, but I don't want it to curl up. Hard bristle brush. So lick that on down. What's up, y'all? I know y'all are looking like, whoa, wait, what is going on? Alright, so after all of that, I don't even know how much I'm going to cut out and show you guys and all of that. But after all of that, me straightening it, me flat ironing it, me cutting it, my friend cutting it. We went out that night and I was like, the more we cut, the more I like it. So I was just feeling like I really want to go back to my original vision of the short, short side. 
I said I didn't want it shaved, like, you know, see my scalp shaved. I really wanted it short. So two people in the same day brought up the idea of a barber to me. And I'm like, I don't want to do a barber because all I thought of was shave, like a dude. I was like, I don't want that. So then they were like, well, barbers can use clippers to cut your hair. So I'm like, hmm. You know, on Google, research, all of that, I find out that barbers can't do that. So, y'all, I went to a barber and he cut my hair. And when I tell you I love it, absolutely am in love. He knew exactly what I want before I could tell him he was finishing my sentences. So this is shorter right, right here. And then when you get back here, it's a little bit more hair, a little bit more hair. He kept my angle going for me. Um, this side right here, I just have it slicked down and brushed with some elastic QP and a little bit of gel. Um, and then I just, you know, flat iron this side in love, this is what I want, this is what I should have done. Like I said, when I first went and got the blonde, it was just, like I literally looked in the mirror and was like, and it was such a shot, I was like, I cannot do a short side and this blonde all in one. I was just overwhelmed, so I'm glad I went back and finally did it. It gives me that newness that I've been looking for. I have definitely been looking for some newness. I was so bored with my hair. Like I always say, I am going to go back to Jet Black. Absolute favorite hair color. I'm going to go back to Jet Black Curls. I love curly natural hair. But right now, I need something different. I'm going to cut this off, grow it back out. That's a whole other part of the journey. But here it finally is, guys. After all of that, me thinking I can do it myself. Go to a barber. Alright, hope you guys like it. Peace and blessings, thick and curly.